Welcome everybody, this is Jonathan, and we're back with another SAT math video. So we're going to be tackling an SAT math problem, and let's get straight into it. So the question asks, the number y is 84 less than the number x. Which equation represents the relationship between x and y? So what we're going to do to solve this problem is we're going to go through each answer choice and we're going to eliminate the answer choices that are wrong and then eventually we'll figure out which one is right by the process of elimination. So this strategy is always great if you can't immediately find the right answer choice because by getting rid of wrong ones you'll eventually find only one possible candidate for the right one so you'll know it's that choice. So let's start with A. So we have y equals x plus 84. Let's think about what this means. So this means that if x was, for example, 10, then we would have y is equal to 10 plus 84 is 94. So that would mean that y is 94 when x is 10. But the question says the number y is 84 less than the number x y is less than x, and for this equation we had as an example y is 94 and x is 10. So that means that this choice is wrong. Okay, let's look at answer choice b. y equals 1 over 84 times x. So let's pretend that x is 84, and then we have y is equal to 1 over 84 times 84 is just 1. So y is 1 and x is 84. Does this fit what we need it to? So we need it to we need to have y as 84 less than x. And in this case, y is 1 and x is 84. So y is actually 83 less than x. Therefore, this choice has to be wrong as well. Now choice C, y equals 84x. Let's just plug in some numbers and test if it fits what we need it to. Let's say x equals 2, and then we'll have y equals 84 times 2, or 168. So if y is 168 and x is 2, y is not 84 less than x. Therefore, c is wrong. Now, we know that d has to be the correct answer, but let's just double check to make sure. So let's say that x is 94, then we have y equals 94 minus 84, or y equals 10. And 10 is 84 less than 94, so therefore d is the right answer. 